Hi everyone, Carol from Carol's Vintage Treasures and I have a what sold video and a shopping haul from Goodwill for you today. Uh, this is what sold the uh, week of February 22nd through the 27th and I had some really good sales. I had a good week. I sold six items. Oh really? No. <laughs> Peanut gallery over there. She um, does this when I turn my phone on. I don't know why. Maybe she believes I have something in my pocket for her, but I don't. So we're going to carry on. Um, first thing I sold was this Budweiser Stein still in the box. I think it's from the 90s. 1998. But it's just in time for... St. Patrick's Day and it sold for $25.19. That's what it looks like there with the little leprechaun guy. And they're having a Budweiser party. It's marked on the bottom. So $25.19, that was a good sale. And they pay their own shipping, so shipping's not included in that. Uh, next thing I sold was this little guy here. I just listed him and he sold so quickly. Uh, $17.49. You know I have to pick up the Black Lab stuff because of Holly. But other people like it too. So that's good. And the same person bought this one too. This one was $17.49 also. I did lower the price on this one because I've had it for a while. But it's uh, Texas Hearing and Service Dogs Black Lab. It's got the little serv service vest on and the tag. So he is going to a new home and he was $17.49 also. Uh, next I sold some jewelry. I sold this necklace. It's an articulated butterfly necklace. Hopefully I can show it to you this way. That's really pretty. Um, you know I love the butterfly stuff, so I have to have it in my store. <laughs> but it's got the silver tone chain on it. That is really good. That sold for $23.09. And I sold a pair of earrings. Now, I did do a Google image search on these, and I couldn't find a marking on them, but it said they were Lucky Brand. So I listed them that way. And they sold for $20.99. That's what those look like. Very pretty. And all my jewelry that I sell, I put in boxes and um, ship them out nicely, just in case they're gifts, so they'll have a box to send it out in to the person. Next thing I sold was a coffee cup. It's the one uh, for motherhood, I believe. Yeah, mother holds a special part of all that is treasured in the heart. So that's really pretty. And it's from um, Mark My Words. And that sold for $12.59. Perhaps a Mother's Day gift. I don't know. But very good sales this week. I'm really happy with that. Um, I, think I had six items, so that's great. I've been having three or four, so maybe things are picking up. All right. On to the haul video. This is more of that Goodwill haul where I'm stocking up. Uh, so I don't have to go sourcing as much and I can just pull it out of my bins and list it throughout the year. I got, my sign's falling down, I got this wooden and metal fish. It's on a little stand here. I thought that was nice. And this is um, handcrafted in Guyana. So, and this one was uh, $4.49. Some of these things are wrapped up. Sorry if you don't like that noise. But 
it. I got this elephant. It is so heavy. I am not sure what this is made of. It feels cold. I'm wondering if it's marble. But that's what it looks like. It was $5.49. And it does have some ink on it. I'm not sure. Maybe that's a signature. I don't know. I am sorry I had to stop the video for a minute because I had uh, people preaching the word outside my door. <laughs> but anyway, on to this again. Um, there is a marking on it. Let me look here. Grab a thing here. I think they're still out there. I'm sorry. Holly, she's all upset. Uh, upside down. I'm going to try really hard to read this. It's very small. Fair trade handmade in Kenya and that could be a signature of some sort I'm not sure but uh, that's what it looks like there it's really pretty uh, very heavy so I'll have to look into that more but it was 549 warm in here now. I had to jump up because Holly was trying to save the world. Somebody was at our door. Okay. <laughs> I got this. I have an Eeyore glass that matches it. I'm, I haven't made up my mind if I'm going to sell this or keep it. I might keep it. It was $1.49. It's got Pooh Bear on it. And it says friends forever. Ah! Holly, yeah. no. Okay. I believe in religion and God and all that. But I don't like when people try to force it on you. I don't know. It took me like three or four minutes to get them to go away. And they're still out there trying to bother my neighbor. Okay. Uh, Taboo Junior. This is a sealed game. I try to pick up sealed games when they are are out. I don't know how well I'll do with this. Um, it was $6.49, but it is sealed. And I might have to sell that on Poshmark. I don't think it's old enough for Etsy. I found a cake pan. It's Raggedy Ann. Very nice. It was $3.49. And it is Wilton, and this price tag is over the information. Let me see if I can move it a little bit. Uh, 1981. It's from 1981. In really good condition. It doesn't even look like it's been used. I got this for me. Sleepless in Seattle. I think I have one, but I wasn't sure. So I went ahead and picked it up. I love this movie. Anything with Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan, I love. <laughs> I got this. If you're from Arizona, you know these guys, Beth and Bill. Uh, they're radio personalities from probably the 80s. And... You know, the 80s and 90s. Bill did pass away from cancer. It was very sad. Um, but I got this for me because I used to love listening to them. It's just a uh, Cooking with Beth and Bill cookbook. They did have a cooking show here for a while. So I just got that for me. I know. <laughs> Sometimes you have to buy stuff for you, buy stuff for your store, you know. I got a ginger jar. I think it's a ginger jar. No, it might be too... I don't know. I got this. 
and it was $5.49. I thought it was very pretty. And these type of jars do well for me. So I did take the tape off in the store because I always check them out to make sure they're not chipped or broken around the edge. But it's really pretty. I like that a lot. That should do well. And that's all I have for this haul. I'm breaking this up into segments because I got so much. Um, showing it to you and then I'm putting it away uh, to list later on. Uh, since I've gone back to work full time, it's been hard to juggle things. So I'm trying to shop a little and then put it away and then pull it out and list it. So just trying to keep things going. It's hard, but you know, it's something I love doing. So it's something I'm willing to work hard at. Um, I think that's it for today. We had our excitement at the door. <laughs> I'll just piece those two pieces of video together rather than doing it over again. Because what's a video for me without bloopers, right? <laughs> you got to have the bloopers in my videos. All right, that's all I have for today. I want to thank you for watching. Um, if you like what sold videos and haul videos, please consider subscribing. If you have subscribed already, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You're helping my channel to grow and that means a lot to me. So thank you so much. Uh, comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item was or just say hi. I like saying hi to you guys. And if you know someone that likes these kind of videos, go ahead and share it with them. They might like it. And like, comment, and subscribe. That's it. I guess that's it for today. I have to say goodbye. It's hard for me to say goodbye. But anyway, thank you for watching. Have a great day. And I will see you in the next one. Happy thrifting.